five, four, three, two, one. You're open. What's going on? What's going on? Welcome back to Hot Seat with Icy Jones. You know we in the one o'clock hour, man. Got the homie in the building. You feel me? I got Day Deuce in the building, man. <laughs> All trap my name. ATM, hey, man. What's happening with it, family? What's going on with you? How you feeling, brother? Huh? My long, my long, my long partner right here. Yeah, man. man. Long time, man. Long time, man. Long time. We grew up together. This nigga was my big homie. This nigga. Yeah. You know, he 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 been around me for a long time. I'm trying to get you in there. There you go. Sliding back. Yeah. Sliding let's see how that looks. Right Turn you to the left a little bit. Okay. Let there me scoot go. over for you. Okay. There, there you go. go. Yeah, man. So, uh, purple heart, purple heart. Yeah, I like this uh purple Letterman jacket you got on oh, here, yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Shout out to fi my fiance. She did that. Yeah, you know what I mean? she did. You school closer to me. Uh, she always do her shit for you know. Ah, uh, there we go. There you go. Yeah, we in there. We in there. Hi. We in there. What's up, live? <laughs> they dudes live. Yeah, yeah, yeah man. man. Let's get it right up in here, man. So, uh, brother, brother, you been working, huh? Yeah. Um, never stop. Yeah, no, nah, nah, I, uh, I never stopped working, actually, you know. I right. just um, took a couple breaks, you know what I mean? Had to run the bag up a little bit, but I always That's a stayed must. working. I always stayed working. It cost a lot of money to do this. Yes, and now <laughs> that you do, it costs, man, it costs so much money, like, to put into... Everything, interviews, project, album cover, studio time, features. This shit, it's like, man, it's like you don't get no profit mm -hmm. until you... Yeah, you got to invest. Man, I don't know. <laughs> and, I, and that's the main thing. Motherfuckers don't understand that. We got to invest. Yeah. But, you know what I mean? And we have to get up out of this pot that we in mm -hmm. called Vegas. Mm -hmm. I mean, we have to get up out of here. It's yeah. it's, it's, it's pathetic. Like, yeah. we have to get out of here. Ain't it crazy? It was, it's terrible. It's in several different areas. Yeah. You know, one thing that's actually going great right now, they do, is the unity. The unity is going good. Yeah, I mean. Yes, the unity is going good with, um, with Vegas. But I feel like, you know what I mean? This, and I'm going to start addressing this shit on every interview. Niggas is content with being Vegas famous. Mm. Man, I'm, that shit ain't going to get us nowhere. Yeah. Being famous in Vegas. Yeah. Niggas is content with that. Dropping their tape. Dropping dropping their tape on Facebook. Dropping their tape on IG. And that's it. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow. I get a couple likes, a couple shares, and you know what I mean. Boom, that's it. On to the next. On to the next. And yeah. You you feel like you're famous because you got what five hundred likes, and it's being Vegas famous ain't gonna get Vegas to the mainstream. Yeah. Where we wanted to get it. Yeah. It's not. <clears throat> it's not. See, this is the thing because we all we're always compared to somewhere, right? So people can't compare Vegas to California. Mm -hmm. They can't compare Vegas to uh, New York. You can't mm -hmm. compare a city to a state. You can't compare a city to a state, and you can't compare a city to a city that's been established longer than our city. Our Man. city is only, what, 50 years old? Well, 60, Vegas in general 70. being built is over 100 years old, right? Being built. Yeah. Right. But when we talk about our community of music, nah. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, we're the mm -hmm. uh, entertainment capital of the world, but it has nothing to do with the local scene. No, never. You know what yeah, I mean? Never had nothing to do with any local scene, like, ever. And never. when it comes to Vegas being compared to, like, a, a L.A. or a SoCal or mm -hmm. a, a Atlanta or a Chicago, mm -hmm. you can't do it, man. No, you know what I mean? You can't. But we are... Rising, right? We rising together, but we have to get out of here. Get out of here. We have to get niggas have to get up out of Vegas to to 
We have to get up out of here and rub shoulders with the right motherfuckers. Yeah. To let them know that we from Vegas. I'm an artist from Vegas. He's an artist from Vegas. Boom. Yep. Man. You know what I mean? That's that's what we have to do. Motherfuckers have to be in L.A. L.A., L, uh, it's niggas from Vegas that I know that ain't even been to L.A. Mm. Like, you know, and that's pathetic. Yeah, that's it's not okay. It's not cool. That, like, where it, Let alone Atlanta. Yeah, Atlanta. You ain't even drove four you, hours you, to you go down. You ain't even drove four hours to really, that's the, um, that's the, inner, uh, that's not the entertainment. That's the entertainment capital to me. <laughs> that's uh, the mecca. <laughs> yeah, that's the mecca. Uh, L.A., yeah, yeah. Hollywood. That yeah. they run the fucking. Uh, they rule the world basically because yeah. they 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 rule what's on TV. Mm -hmm. uh, Hollywood does so. And Atlanta's black. Hollywood. And uh, Atlanta, Atlanta is black Hollywood, but Hollywood rules the world. The, 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 you know what I mean? Because they are the ones who control what puts out. To the, the to the you know what I mean? Yeah. They the ones who control what everybody's watching. Right. You know what right. I mean? So why not why are we not why is it not Vegas artists in LA on these events, you know what I mean, rubbing shoulders with certain motherfuckers, right. you know what I mean, to get us in the door. Right. And we have to move when not even move as a unit, even if you your your little camp, y'all move as a unit and go you know what I mean? Go to L.A., right. you know what I mean? Book studio times, you know what I mean? I ain't saying do no motherfucking videos out there, but, you know what I mean? Do Go business. Out there, do, out, do business, because that's where everybody lives. I was just when, told. When a motherfucker, look, when, uh, uh, real quick, when, yeah. when a motherfucker makes it in the rap game, where do they move to? Yeah. They move to? L.A. Or Atlanta. Yeah, or Atlanta. Where it's Atlanta going. Atlanta moved to L.A. Where, LA yeah, where it's going on. So yeah. if a motherfucker that's big moves there, why wouldn't you? Why wouldn't motherfuckers go there to try to get, you know what I mean? And, mm -hmm. but, you know, when they retire, they like to come to Vegas. Yeah, they retire <laughs> and come to Vegas. Motherfuckers retire spend, and come to Vegas. Spend some of that old money. Yeah. You know what I mean? But they're not looking to, to work with nobody, man. You know what I mean? Because nah, they, uh, they, 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 they done retire. Come, they want to come party. Yeah. So... Uh, when it comes to you in general, man, have you recorded in LA? Yes. And wh mm -hmm. who was in? The was somebody in the studio, like in the building um, when you were there? No, I think who was in LA? Uh, I think Gunplay was in there. Gunplay. Okay. Um, I mean, nah. Nah, okay. it's just probably like gonna play. But if you book a couple of sessions, I'm not saying, you know what I mean, your session is gonna um be have uh an artist there, but you never know who's you don't you, you never know who's gonna you be don't. walking in. You never know who's gonna be, you know what I mean? Yeah. You could meet I was in um North Hollywood or West Hollywood going to Fat Burger and I met uh Mars. Okay. Mars, um the one that's over uh, 1500 and that. Yeah. I met him right there. Boom. Got his number. Yeah. Chopped it up. You yeah. know what I mean? It's just being out there and being in the right position. You know what I right. mean? Putting yourself in the right position so you can get ahead right. in the, in the, in the uh, industry. What has been consistent done for you? What has um, continuing well, your mm, music mm. As an independent artist, what well, has it done for you? Being consistent, what it had, what it, if, I ain't seen no, I'm trying to see a profit from this shit. I ain't seen, I ain't got too many rap checks. I got a couple features that I got paid for. That's cool. Um, being consistent got, allowed me to um, master my craft more. Okay. You know what I mean? Allowed me to be way more comfortable on the mic. You know what I mean? And um more confident. Yeah. Confident and comfortable. Yeah. All that. So yeah. um that's what it did gain for me, but um I was consistent at making music. Now I'm working on being consistent at putting out music. Mm -hmm. So right now I got my um I got a Purple Heart. Purple Heart. 
Us Volume One Boom. Okay. I had two tape. I had a. I was gonna put one whole tape together. Yeah. And I had like twenty four songs. Okay. I scrolled through. I was gonna put them all together. Boom. Sixteen, seventeen songs. Instead, I chopped them up and made two tapes. Okay. Made two tapes. So I got two tapes. Um, well, I got Purple Heart Volume 1, then I'm going to have Purple Heart Volume 2. Okay. But it's already done. Yeah. You know what I mean? It just need probably like a verse here, verse here. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. And I learned like my, one of my engineers, Pat, he uh, told me, he like, man, chop it up, make a 10, put 10 songs on there, save the other 10 for right after so you could keep hitting them, hitting them. You know what I mean? I got tape with Yada. I got a tape with another tape with Tony O with Tony O Mob, free Tony O Mob. You know what I mean? And um like I'm just trying to get consistent of putting music out. Yep. Mm-hmm. That's yep. what we have to do. So I got a phone full of music that needs to get out. And that's what I really been focusing on. It's like getting getting this shit out. Mm, Purple Heart on the way right now. Yeah. <clears throat> now, when is uh, Volume One release? Uh, on the twenty seventh. Okay. Uh, I was gonna do it on two 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 twenty two two thousand twenty two. So I was gonna do that the year of the deuce. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's what I might call. That's what I might call the next step, the year of the deuce, because it's twos everywhere. It but, is. Um, it is. You know what I mean. Shout out my engineer Pat. Shout out C Ready. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? C Ready, that's another uh my boy up and coming. He got a studio right here on uh Famigo. Any mm-hmm. uh any videos out yet? Uh yes. Fuck it up is out. I just dropped Fuck It Up. It's um a single, but it's not on the tape. Okay. I mean, I just dropped Fuck It Up. Um my next video is that's dropping it's probably Dope Talk. That's already done too. Shout out my boy LJ. Shout out to LJ. Mm-hmm. And how many on this one? Uh, how many what? How many songs? On the tape, uh, 10. 10 songs? 10 songs. 10 okay. songs. 10 songs. What's I the... Put, uh, get It Get it Is Out. Get It Is Out uh, on YouTube and uh, Apple Music and all that. Um, I don't think Fuck It Up is... Uh, I think Fuck It Up dropped tomorrow on Apple Music. Okay. So I'm just trying to get more attention to my page, get more attention to my name. That's yeah. why I drop fuck it up. Yeah. You know I mean, it's just one one still one still shot um scene. You know what I mean? Location, boom. It's a visual. Yeah, just a quick visual. And uh why you didn't put it on the tape? Um for more just for more attention or what? Uh oh really I don't know. I feel like I shoulda mm-hmm. but I already had uh get it on there. Okay. So it's two strip club songs. You know oh, I mean? so get it is going to be on there. Get it is on the on the on the tape as a bonus. Okay, bonus is the last song. Okay, so mm-hmm. for those who don't know you, what's this Purple Heart man? Oh, Purple Heart. Um, it means a lot of stuff. You know what I mean? It's like what the highest. Uh, it's what you get during war. Yep. So, like, um, if you didn't did put in a. Ample amount of work, you know what I mean? <laughs> you know what I mean? You put in an ample amount of work, you know what I mean? So you put in work, you get a purple heart. And I feel like <clears throat> with this music and um, representing my section, mm-hmm. you know, uh, I deserve mm-hmm. a purple heart. So Wait. that's why I put purple heart, you know what I mean? Yes, sir. I'll yes, dro- sir. I'm dropping the tape on the 27th because that, uh, that's my boy, Javon. Um I'm gonna live to run. You know what uh, I mean? That's my boy. That's my boy' birthday. So, okay. you know what I mean, that's okay. why I put him, put him on, you know what I mean? dedicated the whole tape to him. And this him is and T-Lo, You know what I mean? All you know, trap money. All trap money. Yeah. All trap money general. You yeah. Know what I mean? Yeah. So, um, I don't know. All trap money. It is. And you right. got a barber shop. Yeah, 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 yeah. Huh? Barber shop. Uh, GQ Cuts. GQ Cuts, GQ man. Cuts. Let me see that thing, man. GQ Cuts. GQ Cuts Barbershop, all right? Mm-hmm. Specializing in today's styles. Mm-hmm. $5 off with the flyer? Yeah, that's with the flyer. Okay, now. 
GQ Cuts Barbershop is located at 2605 South Decatur Boulevard and it's Suite 106 right here in Las Vegas, Nevada. You feel so me? here in Decatur next to Aloha Kitchen. Word. And right it's next. open Monday through Saturday, 9 a.m. to 7 p.m. And they open on Sunday. We, we open all... We open... We don't really close until... Seven days a week. Yeah, the last person... Man, yeah, that's and that's right. so Sunday they open ten to five, but you know, like you said, mm-hmm. the last person cut. Yeah, and once again, it's twenty six oh five. Yeah, South Decatur Boulevard, Suite one hundred and six, right next to Aloha Kitchen. Literally, you feel Literally. me? So, uh, twenty six oh five. Yeah, man, you you may catch oh. this commercial on the show. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. So yeah. Also with the shop, um, um, right now I've been focused on getting the uh, tape out. Yeah. Right now, focus on on promoting the tape, yeah, um, and everything. But I'm um, about to do uh, my own podcast. Okay, and um, shit, I want you e- either you. I hit Tizzle. Yeah, I um, mean, I don't know if Tizzle was uh, he gonna be too busy or whatever. But I know Pilot K- Talk, K Fly, K Fly. Uh, Said he was going to get on there. Hey, you? Room Service yeah. Radio. Yeah, so um, I'm going to do my own podcast called um, Hip Hop in the Shop. Okay. You know what I mean? I like it. Hip Hop in the Shop. I got the logo for it made. Yeah. And um, we going to basically be sitting in the uh, barber chairs. Yeah. You get your lineup. I'm going to feature um, every, every, I'm going to probably do it every two weeks. I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start off with one once a month, but. Gradually, yeah. I'm gonna go up to two weeks. Okay, you know what I mean every biweekly. Two, yeah, two artists, two artists a month. Okay, or whoever's doing some in the city. Yeah, that's positive and got something going. Yeah, boom, we gonna interview them. I mean, I might do, I might do an interview here and there. I might yeah. be asking a couple of questions. Maybe I don't know how I feel. Okay, but I'm gonna be sitting down with as we doing the show. And it's gonna so, be a circle. So you'll be the Host, yeah, and I'll be the co-host or yeah. whatever. I'll just be sitting. We just gonna be sitting in the barber chair taking shots. You right. know, what I, mean? right. pro- I might, I might have an Instagram model. Um, um, Sorry, one man. of the lovely, yeah, one of the lovely ladies from Las Vegas or some. Maybe I might use one of them Las Vegas baddies, motherfuckers. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, you don't know. You know what <laughs> I, mean? I might, <laughs> might reach out to them and tell them. Right. You know what I mean? We are gonna have them. Giving yeah. us drinks, boom, yeah. and we're just gonna be chopping it up, right. getting the scoop on what's going on in the city, what that person is doing, how they feel about the politics in Vegas, and yeah. you know what I mean, how they feel about shit that's going on in the city. You right. feel me? But it's gonna be some tea on there. You know right. what I mean? Right. We're gonna get into the street shit. We're gonna lightweight. We don't want to give them too much. Right. The police on and right. watching, right. so we can't give them. You know what I mean? But we're going to get into the TT. You know 100, I mean? man. Do we have Get It Up? Get It? Oh, um, we, don't, we don't have that video in there no more. Oh, okay. Oh, you ain't got it in there no more? Goddamn. Uh, you took my shit out. <laughs> Goddamn. All right, so what we got out right now, man? You could uh, low fuck it up. That's brand new. I'm about to play the song um, by Dave Fuck it up, fuck it up. F-I-U. Jazzy and my cousin. Shout out my cousin. We got a um, um, show this, this, what, March 4th? Yep. March 4th. I think I'm on the, I'm getting on that shit right there. And I think I'm getting on that show. I'm pretty sure. Not just um, performing with Yada, but doing my own. Having my uh, own slot, you feel me? I can't find it, bro. But so I'm gonna what, 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 what? The song. That, uh, that oh, that's out too. Yeah, I forgot about this. I'm about this to one. play that. Uh, which one you want? Which one? I, I want to FIU, but uh, uh, it ain't popping up. I'm gonna play. Up. Uh, uh, fuck it up, pop up right here. Fuck it up. Yeah. Oh. oh, that's why. Yeah, I forgot about that. He's, Did. He's a. He's a. Yeah, 
Yeah, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm mastering this strip club music and shit. You feel me? Okay. You feel me? It's, 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 I make all types of music. Right. I'm, I'm trying to give them what they want right now. You know what I mean? Okay. in the building hey. i'm about to play did this is y'all today dudes did y'all got a tape coming or something i mean y'all yeah yeah all right now it's all right that shit already done too i'm i'm, I'm debating on i'm debating on uh after i drop purple heart which joint tape i'm gonna do next i might do me antonio's or i might do me and yada's i'm thinking Man. i'm leaning towards me and Yada's then I'm gonna drop uh purple heart. When the last time you hollered at TM? Uh about a week ago. About okay. a week ago. How is he? Oh he alright. He alright. He, yeah. he only got he only got a two two to six. You know okay. I mean? Okay. Um he be he last time he called pretty down and shit, so I had to lift the nigga spirits up. Like, yeah. man, you know, if, you don't worry about this shit, nigga, you can thug through it, you know what I mean? We've been through it. You know what I mean? You're going to be all right, and we gonna, I'm going to put out some of this music for you because he got singles that I could put out right now. Yeah. You feel me? It's yeah. just I'm focusing on my shit right now, so, but I could put, I'm could i going to put out a single for him. You yeah. know what I mean? He's going to walk it down, man. All up. I'm going to put you, out everybody. a single for him. I'm going to put out a way out. Okay. Um, this way out. But I'm, um, I'm going to get a video made for him, just a bunch of, clips and shit together you yeah. know what i mean just 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 to keep his name alive you know what i mean yes sir doing doing shit that a good homie would do he up man mm -hmm. he ain't went nowhere mm -hmm. this did yada they do us <laughs> logo let's go put the logo up there oh you oh you can't put the uh You know that you started. Like you off in the streets, you 
playing with G's, my nigga, we know that you fucked with counterfeit, counterfeit. How come my youngest are handling it? Where them is soaking, we drown shit. Really be down and shit. Constantly putting it works on my business, you better stay out of it. Bro, the sandwich shit, it's like a band when I'm coming. You niggas know how I'm trying. Got me a cake, took that bitch right out the oven. Charge you a band for the onion. Why does me She fuck with me, then she stuffing. I ain't got time for no cuffing. Nigga, I'm clutching. Too much discussion. Say you won't smoke, but he huffing and puffing. All of a sudden, you quit on the bark and you figured out my niggas playing with choppers. Begging and pleading. You a good father, you just tryna make it home safe to your daughter Fuck all that talking, I let it shut out the carpet I put a nail in the coffin, I'm at the table with bosses We probably tick in the office, talk about wins and the losses Hey, man, fattest pistol on me It feel like a missile on me Honey, round drum, I ain't gon' miss your homies Cut the niggas down, I bet you miss your homies I'm poppin' that shit, I'ma lay right there so we hide in the bushes until you come out I know that you pussy, you couldn't come round I stood on the block when the bullets was out Speaking on me, you know you a clown I'm pushing this fully y'all up in your mouth Boop, boop That's that, You know that was light work you know I mean? We got day dudes like, in the building, man We knocked man. that shit out I'm trying to stack up on my videos Make sure I get all my visuals out Yeah You know what I mean? I got three videos already on ice Ready to go Uh yeah. Shout out to LJ. You know what I mean? Shout out to Real House because I got one coming with him. 100. You know what I mean? 100. You know, I'll keep it in the, uh, keep it in the fam. You know That's right. Mean? Y'all do me a favor, man. Y'all need to go to Roku TV. All right? Download the app, Blink Show TV, and make sure you go on the journalist repost and get my show, Hot Seat with Icy Jones. You mm. can watch me in your living room. You feel me? You can watch me in your bedroom. You feel me? And that's under Blink Show TV on Roku TV, all right? So the Blink Show TV app is on Roku, all right? Mm -hmm. And under Journalist Repost, mm -hmm. it's Hot Seat with Icy Jones. You feel me? Journalist Repost? Yes, sir. All right? Uh, so it's going up in a major way, man. Thank you to Blink Show TV. You can follow them on Instagram, Facebook, and go to the site. That's Blink Show TV, all right? Just how everything is spelled. It's spelled correctly how I said. Blink Show DJ TV. Durong. All right? Shout out DJ Do Wrong, man. What's happening with it? Shout out so, DJ Do Wrong. When your next show? Um, I, I'm on. I believe I meet with the guy to uh, get on the uh, show on, on the fourth. Okay. So mm, I, I I pray they don't. No, you know what I mean? The police they just be. Yeah. I heard they set some shit down in uh in Cleveland over uh, with Bay Blue like. Yeah, that's like crazy. they 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 literally called the Cleveland police from out here. Like, no, they tried to, but they, they didn't. They didn't. I don't think they were successful. Yeah, yeah. Now, when it comes to uh, business, they do. Why a barbershop? Um, <laughs> I really didn't. Uh, I, me, I'm the type of person. I'm, I'm not scared of failure. Okay, you know what I mean. So, shit, we gonna like. Oh shit! What the fuck? That was me. Um, yeah, me. I'm not scared of failure, and I don't, I feel like nobody should be scared of failure. Like, I'm not scared of what people say. I, I embrace it. I'm not. You know what I mean? As long as my reputation and there was no smut on my name or whatever, I'm not scared of people's opinion or whatever. With that being said, I mean I ain't scared of failure. I I I jumped in that the barbershop game or whatever. I made the investment, not scared of failing. You know what I mean? And I just, I didn't know nothing about it. Mm -hmm. I just know I wanted to be an owner. Yeah. I didn't want to work for nobody. So with that being said, don't be scared of failure. I, I jumped in. I don't, I, I, I just, it was an opportunity I, I went over it with a couple people, yeah. and majority of the motherfuckers told me not to do it. Okay, and they was like, "Oh no, uh, you ain't gonna, you ain't gonna um, succeed. Do this? No, they ain't like they didn't say I wasn't gonna succeed. They was just like, make sure you just know a little bit more. Okay, you know what I mean? And I just was like, what do you, what do you mean, know a little bit more? Like. As far as business, yeah, I'm going to learn as I go. Mm -hmm. I'm going to learn as I go. I'm not scared. You know, if I fuck up, I learn not to do that and Again. keep pushing. Yeah. You know what I mean? So I just went ahead and got that motherfucker and bought, bought it. And when I bought it, it had five 
five barbers. Soon as I bought it, it went up to eight. Okay. <clears throat> Soon as I bought it. So that was God telling me, like, you know what I mean? I I shout out shout out Dollar Dollar um Jeremy Green. He do music too, but okay. he got a um he got a barber shop called In House Cuts and he the one who told me. He the one who told me to do that shit. And he was so when he told me he was so adamant about it, and I was like, I'm doing it. You okay. know, I'm doing it. Like, So I can't really tell you why. I just know I wanted to be a owner yeah. of something. I wanted to have something that was mine, and legally I could put my name on, and if I want, I could pass it down to my kids. You know what I mean? The opportunity came, you grabbed it. And I grabbed it, you know what I mean, yeah. regardless of what everybody else said. Right. You know what I mean? Absolutely. And, I got a lot of no's and all that, but I ain't paying no mind to it. I want to hear somebody tell me why I should yeah. get it. And Jeremy was the person to tell me, like, yeah, hey, you should do this. I, I jumped on that thing, and I was it. Dude, yeah. you ever been in in the merch game for your, for your, your career, your music career? Um, I was doing, okay, so All Trap Money, ATM, the logo. Yeah. The logo. Yeah, I mean, um I was doing um it as a clothing line and it just my mind was everywhere else. You know what I mean? And that shit is hard, the clothing shit, you know what I mean? And I um I basically me and I talked to Quake and everything, we went over it 'cause me and him like over yeah. the um over the ATM clothing line and whatever the brand, yeah. you know what I mean. And we we was building the brand and as a clothing line, but we switched it to merch. You yeah. know what I mean? It's yeah. basically because with the clothing line, you gotta come out with seasons and all this yes. shit and that shit. Yes. So what we did was we was like, fuck, he was like, man, we should just make it as merch and then. Make a website and just start. You know what I mean, just let them come get that shit. Make purchases like that. Right. You know I mean? Right. So, uh, who all on this album? Mm, okay. Right now, um, of course, I got Tony Omob on there. Okay. Oh, that's another video that's out off the tape. Static. Okay. Static. You checked the static out? No. Okay. Um, static. That's with uh, Yada and Antonio. Okay. Then um, what else I, got? I got ESCG on there. Okay. That's probably the biggest feature I got on there. Yeah. You know what I mean? And I'm uh, making sure I get my clearance and everything for that right, right. now as we speak. Right. So my shit is dropped right on the 27th. They won't try to take my song off there. Okay. But, um... Who I else? need to see you and Bankster again, man. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Me, well, me, me and Quake. We, I just, I just got off the phone with Quake yesterday. Yeah. But um, we, we started off working together. All of, that's my brother. Yeah, you know what I mean, but we, like, he, his time schedule and my time schedule, we just don't be. On the same time, but we need to get back because we make good music together. You Absolutely, know what I mean? and um, I feel like you know what I mean. The reason why I did a tape with Tonio first is because um, me and Tonio's speed was on the same speed. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And you know, quite quite he write different or whatever. Me and Tonio, we was more of it's like me and Yada. We work off of each other's. Energy. energy in the studio and we lay it down right then and there. Yeah. You know, Quake, he took his shit home, perfect it, write it, boom. And we get it and they do it like that. Yeah, that's how he do it. But we're going to get one in. I got him on the tape though. He on the tape. Okay. He on the tape. Quake on the tape. ESTG, Yada. Um, and TM the winner. TM. Um, um, the next one, my little brother on. Too blessed. Yes, he gonna be on there. Okay, for sure. Um, 
Who else is on there? I ain't got too many features. That's good though. On there. Out of ten I songs, just, that's I nice. I just got ESCG, boom, ESCG, Tonyo, Yada, um, and Quake. Quake. Yeah, I think that's it. For, for sure. For real. On the next one, I got, I got, I got motherfuckers on the next one. Producers. Uh, producers. I got Deuce Maker Slaps. That's okay. who made. That's uh, that was um Draco's main uh, Deuce Maker Slaps. Okay. He made he made uh, that's the uh, Draco's RP Draco too. I was um Draco's n- number one producer. Yeah. I got Molly. That's that's my my white boy. My little you know what I mean. My partner. He from out here. Okay. He fuck with a uh, free band gang and shit. But okay. Molly, he produced uh, Get It. Okay. He produced, um, he got like three songs on there. Um, Deuce, Deuce Make a Slaps, got like three songs on there. KD, KD, this, that wave, yeah. got one on there. Okay. Um, who else? Uh, I think that's it. Uh, Hitman, oh, L Fingers, I got on there. Okay. I got L Fingers produced Static. Okay. Uh, I think Hitman is on the second one. Okay. Yeah. February 27th, mm-hmm. Purple Heart. Purple Heart. Ten tracks for us. Ten bangers. Ready to go. Ready to go. All right, man. Ready to go. What you want to tell them before we get up out of here, man? Hot see with Icy mm. Jones, man. You know what it is. Um, Shit, Purple Heart. Two, yeah. 227. Yeah. You know what I mean? 22, that's it. Um. Make sure you follow him, man. D a y d u c e underscore a t m. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Uh, follow me on all that. D a y d u c e underscore a t m. Facebook, whatever. Um, what I gotta tell y'all before y'all get I get up out of here. Follow. Don't be afraid of failure. And as far as the mu- music scene, I love our unity. I love our platforms, but. We have to get up out to Vegas. Okay. We not going to shake, make nothing. Facts. We, we not going to, we, we, it's like, think about it, bro. We, we, we are so content with not being heard that we created our own, our own award show. We making our, uh, we got our own platforms and shit. Yeah. But we have to bust Oh, and it's only for us. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's, that's great. That's our local shit. Mm-hmm. But we, what are we going to be just local forever? Mm-hmm. Exactly. We have to get up out of here. Yeah. We have to take our, you know what I mean, our platforms. Boom. You, y'all platform. Let's, let's, let's take our platforms somewhere else. Yeah. You know what I mean? Let's take our shit to surrounding states. Let's, right. let's, let's, let's say, boom, uh, all y'all go out to L.A. and try to get motherfuckers, the out-of-town motherfuckers that come in, mm-hmm. get them on the platform, and lead, get them on y'all platform. And when they on y'all platform, y'all push our local push our local artists on them. Yeah. Hey, we have this artist. We have this artist. Yeah, this yeah. is your this your interview, but you in Vegas. Right. And we have artists, too. And you know what I mean? One of my goals, though, is to have, like, an ESTG, mm-hmm. 12 to 1 o'clock, and then a day deuce. Mm-hmm. One to two, you feel me? Have like a a little baby, you mm-hmm. know what I mean? Uh, and then it's a twin, you know what I'm saying? Like I want to have them on the same show, you feel me? And that we should be in the same playlist, oh. mm-hmm. same row, you mm-hmm. feel me? Like because mm-hmm. that's just what's gonna and happen. The radio, we gotta integrate. The, the radio has to, you know what I mean? Help. We we don't get no. We could barely do a fucking local show, bro. Right. Like you know what I mean? The police are always trying to shut us down. We can't get we can't get no locals in Dre's, which is our biggest fucking platform we got. Yeah. You know what I mean? The Dre's, we can't get no we can't we we can't get no local play in Dre's. You know what I mean? So we we gotta get up out of here. Yeah. Cause sitting up in this motherfucker is just taking up time. Yeah. You know what I mean? If motherfuckers can't go out to Atlanta to to LA and push y'all tape and you know what I mean get on their platform and let them know we Vegas artists like in Atlanta is artists everywhere producers everywhere right you know what I mean right if if an artist can't get up and get up get up out of here and go out there 
bro, and push y'all music, then I feel like niggas shouldn't even be in it. Really, you just out here to be a local joker. And I hate I, like like Big Boo said, I'm way, way more, more than, than a local man. nigga. <laughs> but he, and he's showing you that. And yep. I come in my 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 I come in because like that's my bro. Like when I went to Atlanta, niggas like D Cross shouted me out because he know nigga. It's not too many niggas from Vegas leaving the city and going to push their music. Y'all the y'all the went across the United States pushing and yelling Vegas. Yeah. So I don't see how niggas could even fix their mouth to say something when you ain't even been off off Vegas soil, nigga. Right. Like you ain't even left the city. Right. To push your music. But you 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 telling a motherfucker where he not from and where where he is from? Shut up, nigga! Until you get up out of here and go push your push your shit. You're right. You know what I mean? Like it's it's I, I love all our platforms, but we we have to get up out of here, bro. We do. As niggas is content with being Vegas famous, and that shit is sickening. It's 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 this pathetic. To me, like, you know what I mean? And I hate to say it like that, but I'm about to say that in every fucking uh, interview I get, bro. I'm trying to get up out of here and let here. them know that we are, we let the world know that Vegas has artists. Yeah. Landlord, he's, I love it. He's, he got fans way out there in Nashville. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, that's because he got up out of here. Yeah. He didn't, he, you know what I mean? He got up out of here. He met, his people, boom, and pushed over there. You know what I mean? And got his fan base, built the fan base over there. Yeah, we he has a fan base here. Everybody has a fan base here. I feel like all the top local artists, but you know what I mean, what what is that gonna get us? Yeah, we got it we got you have a portion of the city behind you, but when we go out of town, we're at the bottom, bottom, bottom of the totem pole for one. Yeah. We're at the dirt, yeah. and we have to let them know, hey, a nigga trying to build a fan base out here and let them know we from Vegas and we have artists, and this is what, it's, this is what it is. Yeah. And that's the only way we're going to push as a unit. We can't just keep sitting here and um, sitting here putting our shit out on Facebook, putting our shit out on uh, SoundCloud, putting our shit out on uh, IG, and then – Hoping somebody comes in here and says, "Hey, uh, you know, I like him." You know what I mean? Like I can say, you know what I mean? Shout out to Hitman. He bring a lot of artists through here. You know what I mean? And those artists, they starting to, you know what I mean? Know that we are, we have artists. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? It's up to the producers to 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 when they got an artist from out of town that. To help put us in a better position, push, push. Hey, you heard of Grease Blanco? You heard of Day Dudes? Oh, let me play you some of our artists. Boom. You know what I mean? Let me let me play you some art because you playing these beats for him. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? He ain't gonna want to hear our shit off the dribble, but nigga, make him hear it. Yeah. You know what I mean? And that's what we have to do. Open up I mean, the opportunity, man. We have to. We well, have uh, to get up out of here. Thank you, Day Dudes, for stopping through, man. Purple Heart. Purple Heart in the city. 227. Purple Heart in the city, you feel me? Let's go, man. Appreciate y'all for tuning in, man. Hot Seat with Icy Jones every Thursday and Friday right here on Room Service mm. Radio. You know how it go. Hey, um, so what you going to um, hip, um, um, you going to be on Hip Hop in the Shop? Yeah. You know I am. Everybody's saying yeah, but once I start this motherfucker. I'm there, dude. Like, I need, you know what I mean? I need y'all to, uh, I'm, I'm going with you, Tizzle, K-Fly. Let's go. And we, we could all, matter of fact, we could all be, we could do two two people at a time, two hosts at a time. Boom. Yeah. Uh, let me get my boy Maine on there. Maine, Maine, uh, that do the credit. We're going to, um. I'm gonna interview uh, jewelers and everything. Let's go. And I say we we do it. What? How, how long? An hour and a half. Yep, ninety minutes. Uh, hour and a half, ninety yep. minutes. And then you can chop it. You feel yeah. me? You can chop it. Chop it. Boom. Yeah. Do you think I should um put uh have a nigga kick for, uh, have him do a, like a freestyle? You can. You can if um, you want to. That you brings that brings more. That brings the artists a little bit more, huh? Yeah. It does. Wow. And that's mm -hmm. just for the artists. You yeah. know what I mean. 
you know, you can have people break down, you know, how to start a business, you know, if yeah. they if they a jeweler, like, yeah. how did you do that? You know what I mean? Like, how do you get these diamonds? Whatever. But we can have that breakdown part, and then, and, you know, they can rap in that breakdown part, and then the business owners can break down the business. You feel uh-huh. me? But look, man, you know we live. You feel me? And you uh-huh. know we're going to get it popping yeah. off the camera. So be looking for oh, hip hop yeah. so in the shop. They was just listening to everything we had. <laughs> to um. the game plan. All right, we out. God bless y'all. I love y'all. Peace. Yep.